Where the breakfast is? I know you ain't going. To These two hoes is crazy, okay? <laughs> I'm talking crazy. I need you right in my space. And I need it, baby. I'm late, but I still can check in with you. I know that I need my friends, but I wouldn't want to leave. You know, I wouldn't want to bleed. Even my heart, my mind, my mind. Hey, hey, hey. What's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, guys? So, I'm recording on my phone for this vlog. I'm so sorry, but I have to because I have too much to do and I already have a vlog. Um, on my other on my camera that has to be posted so i just said i'll just record this vlog on my phone so i wouldn't have to be focused on running out of space and this that and the third so yeah i'm recording on my phone i just have a few things to do as y'all can see y'all see my install i need to do a quick little video or something to put in there uh i was well no nah, i could just use this <laughs> I right, y'all see how I had did like the first little part I had showed y'all. I, I basically did the ball cap method, so you could barely like you can't really tell if it's a lace or not. But anyway, so what's on the list today? A lot. So right now I'm going to actually get some bleach from the store. I need to wash my clothes. I have four loads, probably three or four loads that will have to be washed. And then I'm gonna put my clothes in the washer. But what I might do is go and get me and all change or go get well actually i'm hungry so i'm gonna go get this bleach and put my clothes in the washer and then we're gonna go get some food anyway later on today after all of this is done and over with i actually have to go i'm going out to eat so we're going out to eat tonight we're supposed to be going to the out back steak house so I, i'm so excited to take y'all with me and also um other than that tomorrow we're gonna have a Mardi Gras parade we are attending so if you were wondering yes this vlog is gonna be lit it's gonna be lit 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 so stay tuned all right y'all so i put my clothes in the um washer so i think i'm gonna just go ahead on because i only have 30 minutes by now i think i'm gonna get the most important part out the way y'all i think i'm gonna Go get my oil changed. And then. Oh, uh, about to get hit. So, I'm finna take y'all with me. We're gonna go to the closest take five that I always go to. I actually am over. Because yeah, that's important, baby. Keep your oil changed. I've been rolling in my car down here for over a year now. It's gonna be two years next month. Um, I haven't heard any major problems. Probably before we moved down here, I had some problems, but other than that, I've been good. So, all I've been doing is keeping that all changed. And if I notice anything or hear anything different on it, um, I'll, uh, you know, get it checked out. But everything's been good thus far. Like I told y'all, I do need to go and take it and get it looked at. Um, but for now, everything's good. So, that's what I'm gonna do right now. I'm going to take five plays. Depends on how long they may take. I'm, it's already 2.21 and I wanna be back at the washer for three o'clock. There's also someone drying clothes, so that's good. They not the time in the dinner. I think the dinner starts at seven o'clock, I think y'all. I kinda wanna make a other few stops. I wanna just talk to y'all. I wanna just talk to y'all about you know, I seen I was watching this podcast. I like to watch podcasts now. Um, so Rich and Unemployed. I was watching Rich and Unemployed, and he has a great podcast. He asks a lot of questions. He even make good comments, and you know, he just get to the details, and he don't judge his his guests. You know, so he has like a lot of influencers on there. Uh, he he does a lot of uh, interviews with badass models. Okay, <laughs> y'all know they be bad. So let's keep it real. 
but anyway so he was interviewing Ray Loso and I love Chris um I think her name is Chris Summers. I watched her. It's hers like two hours. I watched it. I had to come back though. I didn't watch the whole two hour thing. But I think Ravi Loso was almost two hours. I think. I don't know. But him and her, they kind of touched base on a good topic that was towards the end of the podcast. And he was like, she was talking about speaking on basically how some women be down in me, y'all. Like, um, the man do right for one woman, but another woman he might have not she might have not just brought that out of him kind of like if you watch the show sisters by tyler perry then you see like what karen and uh fatima and zach they're kind of like that situation if you want to know what she was referring to um and then he made the comment though the comment he made it's kind of like something i went through in a lot of family i had and you know just a lot of other people in this world and i'm glad he said that i'm glad it came from him a man so he was like, yeah, but it's also situations where women hold men down and, you know, they stick to stick with them and put in all that time. And then once the man comes up and finally starts living in his potential, is he going to stay down with the woman or is he going to stay there or is he going to change up on it? And I was like, damn, he hit it. You know what I'm saying? Like, he really spoke because that's the question that a lot of people okay they don't got that many cars thank god that's the question that's the topics basically that's stuff that a lot of people need to be discussing because that's not the case you know people be quick to say hold them down hold them down and then when you don't hold them down you got to be this person that's just so bad and wrong but every day this new generation and not in just a new generation i think this stuff been going on for years excuse me but every day i'm just reminded of not to do that like i'm not gonna do nothing that i'm not comfortable with anymore because i got options for one and for two and it's not even about men options just saying that my mother wants me to come stay with her right now so when it comes to like holding people down and picking them up when they down i would no longer do that because that has never been something that i was comfortable with doing i'm just not a bad person put it like that so i'm not going to do anything that i'm uncomfortable with anymore because I love myself and how I feel, how I feel, it just seems unfair when they do what, just what that man said. Because for him to say that, that also just clarifies, like he, for it to be coming from a man, I just gotta say, he really spoke because to come that coming from him, it, it meant a lot, you know, because there are so many women going through that currently. There are so many going, so many women going through the fact that these men. Let me see what they want me to pull to. I guess over here would be good. Uh, I could pull over here, huh? Get an oil change. That's all you trying to do? Yeah. Right. Oh, thank you. Okay. Feel like you was flirting. But yeah, y'all. So. Y'all better do my damn oil change right because they always got different people up here, y'all. But yeah, this, I'm glad he said that because that really don't be the case. When men get money and stuff, it's been a lot of that going on too. Shit. If we want to speak on it, let's talk about old girl that with the producer, whatever he is, he makes really good music. Can't take his talent away from him. Um, but his wife is currently going through that with him. Uh, damn, what's his name? Yeah, his wife is currently speaking on that. Um, you know, basically how she held it down for him and you know now he wants a divorce she kind of like put her plans and everything to the side and you know basically pushed her life to the side to you know make sure they accomplish his dreams and that's what a lot what a lot of people a lot of people are quick to say what well, is part your partner uses you and your partner do that but a lot when a lot of y'all are bringing them ideas and you're talking and y'all are discussing on coming up or y'all just talking about what y'all gonna do i think it'll be very important to let people know and you, then you can honestly get that too from what a lot of people be saying when it just seemed like they just including themselves you know they don't really end, plan on including you in their plans so you just have to make the decisions you know to do shit differently so yeah that's the case um well yeah I, I would say don't hold nobody down y'all unless it's something that you really want to do uh because you have to deal with the consequences in the aftermath. I don't know if you're going to come up, you know, because you was done wrong. 
Y'all, so I didn't got the oil changed or whatever. Now, I'm finna be headed to the house. This all they all giving people with all that money, y'all, y'all. Shit. Some stuff to throw out in the parade tomorrow because we're gonna be at, we're gonna actually be in the parade like we're gonna be in the parade y'all so but anyway i'm gonna check back in with y'all um, i don't know i'm gonna try to show y'all my outfit and everything i might even take some pictures but yeah i hope y'all like my hair because i'm loving the install this is some good hair too this is a good texture hair um it's very very bouncy So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna check in with y'all probably once I get my Starbucks. Probably just how I'm gonna start with your free day. Hi, I uh, did an app order for a grilled cheese and I want to say a strawberry, uh, venti strawberry drink. It's for um, Granisha. I'm sorry, it's for Granisha. All right, so I am out of grilled cheese. Um, uh, is there something else that you want to What's up, y'all? So, I actually have my clothes and everything. I look, I'm like really sweaty. Because <sighs> I just had to carry these clothes from the wash, from the wash interior to up the stairs in my apartment. And these are the clothes. Two full baskets, like I told y'all. Yes, it's time for new baskets, but fuck it. Look, I'll be moving soon, so... Like the time is literally flying and it's like i'm just like i don't know thought i was gonna have someone need to refill that jug i have water in here though i guess i just picked that cup because it was closer but i still need to make two more stops y'all two more two more runs actually i need to make more than two runs i need to go to the store i need to get some stuff to throw tomorrow and if I talked to my mom, if I had a thought about it, I could have got the stuff. And I mean, I could have ordered me some flyers and use my book cover and put the book on there, like to just say coming soon or something. And I could have threw them out, but I don't know. You know, and I think she being kind of told me, but if I had to did them online, I don't think that they would have been back in time, you know, but whatever. So whatever it's okay if anybody asks me i could just tell them about it in person or something and i just gotta keep promoting that washing powder smells so good they look like they did did fix their washes and dryers i need to take this trash out it's not even full but it has food in it and when you have food in your trash it makes your house smell but mine doesn't smell because i have the top over the trash but yeah so Okay, I'm going to be doing a very casual, casual, cute look for tonight. And I want to show y'all. I might not take y'all in rainbow or nothing like that with me because I'm not going in there to just shop, shop. I'm only going in there to probably find some pants that are more so like these. I'm going to show y'all. Hopefully, I can get these pants on. When I say I love joggers, I love joggers. Like, I absolutely love them. And, whew, I need to breathe. I think I'm going to wear these boots because they won't kill me. We're supposed to be going somewhere after. I just want to wear a heel, so I think those would be more suitable, more cute. Like boots with a turtleneck, and these are the joggers. So I love joggers. Love, love, love joggers. These. I got these from Rainbow, and they are hugging me. This is like, they got like a wide leg at the bottom. And this is how they look. This is the front. This will be the back. This is the back. Of course, they're going to look wide, y'all, because I'm wide. But they are so cute. They just fit me so, so, so tight that I just kind of feel like they will be good to wear. But will I be able to get in them? I struggled last time when I was up there with my mom and them. And I don't, I don't remember the weight that I was when I put them on. <sighs> but if I was 230, then I should be able to get in them. But like I said, I don't remember it. So I don't know how they are going to fit. So, but I want to get 
me a couple more pairs of those. Uh, I went to the party store though and got some stuff to throw tomorrow for the parade. I don't think I'm gonna go to Rainbow. I got some cups to throw. These were only like nine dollars, I think. I think, I don't know, 13, 14. And I got all these footballs to throw, which is actually good. I'm glad I picked those because that's what he is. He's a football player. So they should be expecting a lot of football stuff. And I got a whole thing of beads. Well, I got a little bag of beads, but, and um, cause I have to go out to eat in the next couple of hours. We meeting at Outback Steakhouse for seven, not 7.30. She just clarified it for me. So um, it's actually 4.56, it's about to be five o'clock and I wanna get out the way of the five o'clock traffic. So I'm going back to the house and in the next 30 minutes, I'm gonna start getting myself ready. And I actually need to see how far Outback Steakhouse is from here. And then after we leave the steakhouse, we're going somewhere else, I guess, as like a dancing place or something, I guess. Maybe to listen to some music, do a little drinking, you know, something like that. We're celebrating my cousin, cousin's 40th birthday. Um, so I'm very excited to celebrate with her, you know, excited, ecstatic. I'm all down for celebrations. But anyway. So, I'm going to check in with y'all once I am done getting dressed, done, dr you know, dressed and prepared and ready. Hopefully, I can get in my pants. What's up, y'all? Let me turn the music out. What? Oh, oh, yeah. All right, you guys. Your girl is ready. I'm ready, y'all. And these pants are fitted, honey. You're going to see them on the... You're going to see me. I got to follow my Instagram because I'm going to put me some pictures up. Now, I'm gonna try to get one of my family members to take me some pictures tonight. I'm sweating, I'm sweating, I'm hot. I'm here. So, yeah, this is the outfit. Uh, I'm trying to see if I'm supposed to turn that. I'm gonna have to flip the video around, whatever. But, yeah, this is how I'm dressed. I have on um, my anklet boots, as y'all can see. And this is the bag. These are joggers. Y'all see? I got them pulled up over this stomach, honey, and they fit. And I thought they, y'all know we, what we discussed earlier, but they fit in. Okay. I'm looking really cute. I got these earrings from Fashion Nova. And, yeah, my lashes, I don't reward these like three or four times. Of course, they're from my business, Luxury Creations and Extensions, Luxury Everything, just luxury. Okay, I might start putting the business back. On my Instagram, I'm start back selling them. I've been stopped selling them, but whatever. Um, I ordered this wig offline, and it's been wigging. Okay, I'm just sweaty, sweaty. Had the heater on, but these joggers and this shirt are from Rainbow. Pay me, cause I just sent you some business. Period. <laughs> but anyway, guys, I got my fragrance on as well, which is by Coach. Let me show y'all. This is my fragrance, Coach. I got the set. And I'm trying to see if I should bring it with me. If I should bring my little pocket thing. This is what comes in it when you get the set. It'd be like thirty or forty dollars more with taxes and stuff. But it comes with like y'all seen what it comes with, like a little pocket perfume. It comes with like lotion, little cute sack you can put your stuff in. <coughs> Excuse me, but yeah. So this is how I look. I did my makeup. I caught myself just using my contour stick with my powder and then I just did a little lip combo with some black liner and a lipstick. Is that a lipstick or a lip gloss? I don't know. And a lip gloss on top. That's it. But anyway, so I'm about to go ahead on and head out because I think it's like 16 minutes for me. Um, so it's not far. But we're supposed to be there for 7. But it ought to be 6.30 by now. I can't see. Go ahead on and head there. I'm gonna check in with y'all once we get to the restaurant. Peace. Don't do it. Down down. No, she with one drink. Look like this to this. But you had it. You had a baby right? I just gave it to my mom. She got her baby. That's an eight ounce. That's two. Who's gonna get both? So I thought it was just one. So you have to get both. Here they was all three. Hey, one, two, three. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday.
They look like big money, honey. <laughs> Take these boots off. I'm so happy my pants ain't fitting me as tight as they was. And taking the shoes off. Plus, it feel like I had to use the bathroom. And I seen like the place was closing and people was sweeping over us and we like okay that's disrespectful <laughs> okay it's like sweep over who some things i'm learning in this lifetime it's a lot of people and a lot of things you're gonna have to walk away from in order to grow and 
everything is going to be very uncomfortable because it's new experiences, it's new things, you know. But you just have to make decisions to be a better you. I need to take this off, this shirt off. I'm trying to see if I should put this Noxzema cream on here and rinse it out before I get in the tub. I'm gonna need to go ahead and take this. No, I guess I'm taking off my makeup for y'all. So, <laughs> so we gonna put on our I just like to do this. I just got into this. Um, I just always feel like the makeup is never fully off unless you like rinse and wash your face off. Let me wash my hands before I put my hand in my face. I'm gonna be using these. I don't have no tripod on. To wash my hands. That's the soap from Bath and Body Works in case you was wondering. So I wash my hand, I'm just gonna take one hand and dip it under this warm water and just kind of do this. Okay, perfect, perfect, okay. Dip my hand in my Noxzema cream. And I'm just gonna rub it in. I just kind of feel like, you know, You should always do some kind of skincare. See, because I can still see as I'm rubbing this Noxzema cream on here, I just actually got makeup in the um, Noxzema cream now. Look. See, y'all see that brown? Y'all see how white that damn Noxzema is, so. Yeah, I know that brown coming from that makeup. Oh, then I got this wig on also. I well, definitely want to make sure we ain't wiping out the makeup from the wig. And now, uh, I'm wasting a whole bunch of Noxzema cream. I'm wiping the makeup off for the night. Thank you, God. I'm dying, I'm in die. I'm muddy. <laughs> Damn, we got that though, but I need something to wash my face. I need something. All right, now for the rinse is all fun. Good, I got my band on. Mm. <laughs> All them time I some going out, bitch, I gotta get up in the morning. From child hoes. We all do because they all fuck to get out the damn fucking thing. Okay, I still see that white stuff on my white eyeliner. Why is that shit so hard to get on? Shit. That eyeliner be so hard to get off. I got the white and the black on. Okay, my water is full. I got my makeup off as good as I can not could. I'm about to wash my face again. A jump very gently. I'm gonna get in the tub. But I think that this is good. Got the makeup off. Better get in the tub and call it a night. I'm gonna check in with you guys tomorrow when we're headed to Mississippi. Hopefully y'all could remind me or I could just remember to get uh what I'm supposed to get. And hopefully I can remember to get me a smoothie for breakfast, you know, just so I wouldn't be hungry before I go up there. But anyway, I'm gonna check in with y'all tomorrow. What's up y'all? So I'm checking in, it's the next day. And it's raining down here. 
Now, I don't know how bad it is up there where I'm from, but that's where I'm headed to. That is where I'm headed to. I got my parade stuff. Okay, wipers, we get it. That man had changed my oil. He say, "Baby, you need some more wipers." <laughs> I don't give a damn. I wasn't buying them from you. But yeah, y'all. So I'm headed up here. I'm actually about to put in for me a smoothie. I remembered. Okay, don't play with me. I remembered. I'm gonna order me a smoothie and then I need to put some gas in my car. Then I have to make a stop at the bank. So, yes, I'm about to actually put in for that smoothie in a little. Um, I just wanted to go ahead on the leave. I don't know what my mama might need help with and it's already almost 10 o'clock. So, even though I haven't heard nothing about them canceling, I highly doubt that they would cancel the fact that the parade is in four hours. 10, 11, 12, 1. No, 3. 11, 12, 1. Only in 3 hours. So it starts at 1. And um, I haven't heard anything thus far. So I highly doubt that they're canceling. Um, but yeah, so I'm headed up here. I got to put in for me a smoothie on my phone. So I'm going to have to cut it off. I need to use it. I'm going to cut the video. I have to come back to y'all. I have to get gas. I have to get go to the bank. So I have to remember these things. So I'm going to need my phone. <laughs> So let me put in my order for my smoothie and I'm gonna check in with y'all once I get it. All right, y'all, I'm recording this with the front side of the camera. Hopefully it ain't blurry. Hopefully it ain't blurry. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. I don't know what the fuck that is, but whatever. Y'all, it is raining, so now everybody don't even know what they're gonna do. They don't know if they're gonna keep having the parade. They don't know what they wanna do. They, um, and everybody said they ain't heard nothing. The parade is supposed to be starting in, in the next couple of hours because it's 1044. So I'm pretty sure people probably fixing their flows or putting their stuff together. But maybe it's raining and it look like the rain is sitting in, honey. Like it's really raining. I know y'all hear it, but it's not I don't know what it's doing in my small town, in my hometown, but I'm on the way there. It's like four to five minutes. From, I'm like four to five minutes, I think. But you know, for real, it's raining, y'all. It's raining, and they don't know what they're gonna do. So, I don't know if we're gonna be in a parade or not, you guys. I just know that it's raining, and I talked to my people, and they said it's raining up there. And I just checked the weather, and it looks like it's gonna be raining. Yup. So they might not even do it. Mm -hmm. Thing is, this is a good Saturday to do it because there ain't even much going on today. Like, um, like really, like this is a good day. This would have been the day for it to really be picked out because they like around where we from. I don't think there's any more parades going on. So this will be the only one to bring everybody from each county if you're not doing it over to the parade no cap my lips cracking my lips cracking let's add some lip chip but yeah i'm headed up there i should be there at almost 12 probably now i'm 30 12 it's 10 45 now so i say 11 30 or 12 i should be there Know what they are gonna do i just know that it's raining and it does look like it's gonna be doing this like it's not a hard rain but it's a rain to keep
Where the breakfast is? I know you ain't going in. Good morning. Brought you some juice, though. I actually just woke up like this, y'all. I really did. I, um, the pee. Today is Super Bowl Sunday. I really want to stay laying down, but I forced myself to get up. Um, I didn't want to sleep around one soon. It's almost 10. But I went to sleep at like one soon. But I got up. I was like, woke for a minute because stuff started. Popping up in my head, so I was like, mm. <laughs> That's mama every morning, y'all. I was like, Let me um, say my prayers because stuff that be running through your head, you know. I was like, Let me rebuke these demons and these devils, and let me pray. And I got up, came to use the bathroom. After I prayed, I think, or I probably prayed after the fact. Either way it goes, I did both. <laughs> I just summed up when. And I got back in the bed, and I laid at the bottom of my mama's bed, and I slept. And I even woke up this morning, and I said, good morning, and I waved at myself. <laughs> no, for real, though. Anytime, yo, you know, you're only human, so anytime your mind, anything, just get the one, you know things or people that you don't want it on or you just feel like it's the devil you can really tell when it's the devil rebuke him and pray don't worry and you go straight to sleep that's like god needs us to do that now we need to know we're still his children he needs to know we choosing him we're choosing what he will you know want us to do instead of you know so I did. I was able to lay right back down and go to sleep. So I thank you, Lord. And I'm saying it on my vlog. Thank you. Thank you, God. And I'm going to thank me. Thank you, God, for putting that in me to do it. And thank you. for Thank me for doing it. Because I, I was like, damn, the devil really be attacking me, huh? And it's like, the, it is like I haven't been having these problems at home. Well, like, probably throughout the day or something or when I get on social media but like like literally like I just feel like last night it was a really, so like a high attack you know so it was a high attack in my mind you know so I was like let me pray so that's what I'll be doing so happy Sunday y'all I'm up uh I think I'm about to get in the tub Brush my teeth and everything, get myself together, and come back to y'all. So I'm gonna check back in once I look a little better, cause it ain't gonna take much to fix. Okay, I never have to do too much. <laughs> 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 you going on my vlog? Look at Diamond. <laughs> hey, look at Mama. Knock me out the top. Yeah, so I never came back on camera to tell y'all, but I'm gonna end the vlog right here. I'm actually headed to Starbucks this morning. <laughs> I'm up a little early so I can catch Starbucks so I can go straight to work. Um, I'm supposed to.
supposed to be at work around this time so i am gonna be a little late but yeah i was supposed to be telling y'all that i wanted to end the vlog because i don't think that i necessarily came on here to end the vlog but this vlog was lit the plans did not go as they were supposed to so what i'm thinking about doing is filming for filming this weekend coming because i think my mother has to be in another parade so we may have to join her in that parade because we weren't able to do it in our parade so we'll be able to throw out some stuff and everything then but um yeah so but that's i might film y'all i don't know because i'm supposed to be filming right again a few days after that for actual mardi gras because we are going to mardi gras to celebrate my auntie lulu's birthday so uh, her daughter you know got plans and we're just gonna help join them and help celebrate so that's a lot of filming y'all i already have this video the video before this one to put out so i don't know if i want to make mardi gras my last video for a while i think i might have to do that because i'm gonna have so many videos to vlog so like i mean to put out i already have my mama's birthday vlog to put out before this one then this one then um, whatever I do this weekend then for Mardi Gras so it's like I'm talking to y'all but I was about to hit that truck so I don't know how I'm gonna do it but yeah so I'm gonna come back to y'all because um it's so many so much I have to put up for y'all you know good content too good content so but I'm gonna check back with y'all. Like I said, I'm headed to Starbucks to get my breakfast this morning. It's, it's Tuesday morning. And um, yeah. So I let y'all stay tuned for other videos. And I don't wanna tell you to drop me, but I don't wanna play your face. Yeah, something that makes me look at you too often. Oh, baby, you can give us something.